Hello, Sass Gang. I hope you all are doing wonderful today. My name is Nati. So, I will be hopping right into y'all energy. I want you all to take what fits and what does not. If anything does resonate with you, hit that like button, comment, subscribe to the channel. Squat rolls if needed. Also, Sash Gang, thank you, thank you, thank you for all the love, likes, comments. Thank you for the support. Thank y'all for everything that y'all do to help the channel grow. I really love and appreciate each and every one of y'all. Alright, so I'm going to do one more shuffle for you, Sash. We're going to hop into y'all energy. So I'm going to make sure my deck ain't going to down, which it looks like it is. Alright. Energy for Sash, please. Okay, ooh. So, I feel like <clears throat> someone, <sighs> give me more spirit. Let me get this sad. Thank you. Someone is about to withdraw from a relationship to focus on their finances here. Someone is about to start being selfish. Okay, you could know this. There's about to be some change here. Okay, someone is about to start being selfish and focusing on their finances. You could be a tarot card reader, Sag, or very intuit or intuitive or a psychic. Your name can start to be or J. This person's name can start to be or J. But this person is going to withdraw from y'all connection. Um, focus on their self. Now, this was a toxic person anyway, so good, cool, okay? <laughs> That's the truth. Good, cool. This person is going to cut you out and, and focus on your on their self. Yeah. They're going to be focused on money. Now, some of you all can fear this. Okay, some, because you know this. You're intuitive. You can see this already. Some of you all fear that, you know, this is going to happen. Energy for so, it's something to where this person is about to recover something here. Okay? Um, and they're going to be happy once they recover something. So, they could have they could have lost a job here. They were searching for riches, maybe in a connection with you. Okay? They were, I wouldn't say using you. But they were trying to get what they could from out of you because they were financially unstable here. This King of Pentacles, possible Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio energy. Okay, I feel like you were very nice to this person. You was a friend to this person. You was there to help support this person. But they're about to start focusing on their self. So this person could be coming into something financially but this was a toxic immature in individual anyways but i feel like some of y'all fear that this is going to happen here because you are a, a psychic you can see what this person's next move is going to be here okay um some of y'all don't want this person to sacrifice you or some of y'all don't want a disunion here but there's going to be an ending to this person here um there's going to be an ending here. I do feel like you are you are extremely psychic. You can get public recognition. Like you speak the truth here, okay? But it's something that you can see when it comes to this Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, possible Libra here, Capricorn. Um, that you just like, you just like damn, like kind of making you mad a little bit, maybe. You were living in an illusion with this person anyway, Sag. Okay, so there's a cycle that's about to end between you both, and you can see it. You can see what's about to happen before it happens. I feel like you're not going to fight it, though. You're not going to fight it. If they want to leave, you're going to let them leave. You're just going to feel like you wasted, their wasted your time with this person. But I do feel like... They're something with this person to where they're fit to come into some big money or they're finna get a job. Okay, you are already financially stable. Like I said, some of y'all are already on a public platform. You're getting public recognition or very popular in your community. Uh, you have big money already. Um, but I feel like if this person is going to want to leave, you're going to let them leave here. Okay, this is someone extremely impulsive here. Uh, so you could be a masculine or a feminine sag here. 
I feel like if they're going to leave, you're going to let them leave. Okay, it's going to come out the blue though. Because this person, their life is just a huge mess anyways. So you, you're going to say, okay, you want to leave, go and leave. Go and leave. Okay, yeah, but I feel like they're going to have single energy. They're going to be focusing on themselves here. Again, we got someone, we possibly got an air sign, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, or a Virgo here, Toy Virgo, Capricorn. See, yeah, so right now this person is very low on their finances, um, and I feel like they cling to you because you are extremely stable, right? Um, but they are going to get stable here, and they are going to release you. They, they're basically wasting your time. They're wasting your time. You're going to find this out here, okay? Uh, yeah, they're going to start avoiding you here. Maybe it's something where they're going to start avoiding, like, coming to your house or... <sighs> it's something to what some of these people even... This could be family members. This could be a mother. Okay, so it's someone that you've been helping... That just has been wasting your time. They've just been using you for what you can help them to achieve or what you can help them do. You could have had them live with you. This doesn't necessarily have to be someone you're dating. This could be a mother, uh, a sibling, okay? But they fit to get themselves together and they are going to just drop you. You are intuitive. You can see this. And I feel like it could make you sad or you fear what you see. But when it happens, you're going to say, okay, go about your business. Go about your business, okay? Then they're going to feel like they made a mistake. Maybe it's something where they feel like you have some imperfections. Or maybe um, it's something to where, like, imperfections with yourself. And this is someone you're dating. Um, they feel like you got flaws or something. That's the truth. So, they feel like you got flaws and they been wanting to cut you out, but they need you. It could be something with your home. They feel like your home is a flaw or something. Some of y'all are about to be moving anyways, okay? But, whoever this person is, is about to come into, they finna recover what was lost in their life. But they are going to withdraw from you, okay? And you are being warned about this person. Because I feel like... Again, I feel like you was living in some sort of illusion with this person or you were being manipulated by this person. But when they do withdraw from you, they're going to feel like they made a mistake or something. Because you still you still gonna be well financially stable to them. Okay, because things have been extremely stagnant in this person's life. They could have lost a car, they could have lost a home. Okay, maybe they had a very toxic lifestyle here, but they're about to come into a big amount of money and they're gonna be happy here. This could be someone who you have a family dynamic with. So this person might start acting funny when they come into this money. Someone is about to start acting funny when they come into this money and you can see this shit. You can see it, Sag. I'm getting any sign out here, really. Uh, yeah, that is so crazy. But if anything resonates, hit that like button, comment, subscribe to the channel, swap roles if needed, and until next time, bye.